We're GV TV, saving you money in psychic phone bills with television originating from Grand Valley State University in beautiful uptown Allendale, Michigan. From our passion pit, located in beautiful uptown Allendale, you're in Grand L.A. with Gregory Struess. I'm the great Daryl Nathan, and now, here's a polar bear at heart, Gregory Struess. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Now, someone was asking me before, there's a division of Butterworth Hospital, and that's quite fascinating. And in case you haven't noticed, you're going to meet him very shortly. We've waited for this in anticipation for the last week or so. The great Daryl Nathan will be performing for us later on. And you know what's kind of funny? This, this past week, we had the chance to go on Mark McGill's morning show. This is on Sunny 104.5 FM. He's, he's telling John, our floor manager, because John works there. And he says, why was Britta, why have all these people been coming on the show and we haven't asked Mark? So this past week, we had a chance to go on the air and, and talk a little bit. And uh, Mark's going to be joining us next week, so we'll, we'll be doing our homework on that one. I just, it's just a, a story. We're catching some attention. Mark uh, was kind enough to have us on his show, and that's something we can talk about next week. So here, for tickets and other information, we got an internet address. We have the old School of Communications address. Uh, lots of old-fashioned, new-fashioned technolo right? technological wonders and how to communicate with us. And Daryl Nathan, the not only Daryl Nathan, the great Daryl Nathan's, going to be sharing how people can write in. So let's hear it for Daryl, Nathan, everybody. <laughs> Read. Read. Tickets. Well, you hear our lovely audience, don't you? Why not become a member yourself? No, we're not dealing with Rogan here. Just plain fun. For tickets or show ideas, please write us in care of Grand LA with Gregory Struess. GV TV. It's not a sermon. Do you want to just come over? <laughs> come on over, Daryl. Come on, let's hear it for the great Daryl Nathan, everyone. How are you? And we were waiting in anticipation to your arrival, <laughs> to your arrival here. I'm glad to be here. Were, were you kind of excited about coming oh, out? Oh, yes. When I heard about it, I uh, said, well, sure. Uh, my business schedule, I had four other places that I had to go. So I... Uh, what were those places? Well, I had, a, I had to go out to a couple of schools. Uh -huh. I went to East Grand Rapids High School and to visit some of my fans. Okay. And I went to, um, no, not East Grand Rapids High School. I haven't been there as of yet. But I'm on my way to East Grand Rapids High School. Okay. And we're, when we talk about the great Daryl Nathan, and, and I, we were just wondering, what makes you, in your own opinion, what makes you so great? Well, when I first started out, I, um, I always created it something that I always wanted. And um, being great is something means powerful. Uh -huh. and Did you feel it's the looks, the, the glitter, the hair? I mean, what, what exactly is it? It's glitter, glamour, fortune, and fame, and power. This is, um, I like long hair and fancy tuxedos and costumes. I believe that every singer should always look your best and give people your best. So that's something that the great Daryl Nathan is, puts out. 
Okay. How long have you been great? Well, since I've been in Grand Rapids, Michigan, um, I've um, done a couple of uh, shows here in Grand Rapids since I've been here. And so things are doing pretty well for me. And then when you answer your phone, you say, what do you say, the great Daryl Nathan's recital hall? Rehearsal hall. Rehearsal hall. I said, what is it? Is that like the corridor between your bedroom and the bathroom? Or is it like one big room? <laughs> what exactly is that? Well, it's like a, it's a little small bedroom. And um, so one day I wrote down a couple of um, names for it. So I thought of the great Daryl Nathan's Rehearsal Hall Incorporated. So from then on, that it became... Sold original. it out to Motel 6 or something, right? No. Okay. You keep the light on? All the time. Okay. Well, Daryl, you're going to join us later in the show for one of your performances, sure. right? And we're, and we're doing this? Okay. And we'll return in a moment with the editor-in-chief of Grand Rapids Image Magazine. John Smith will join us, so stay with us. Thank you, Daryl. Thank you. Thank you.